Hello and welcome. So in today's video, we are going to be performing the lab 38. That is configuring VLANs. Let's get started. Let's fire up our Ubuntu. All right, so if you want to follow along, you can do so from your machine by these uh, instructions. All right, so let's just get started. We're going to uh, probably, since partisan volume, probably will not be able to follow along on your machine unless you have your more knowledge. And if in that case, you don't need this because it's connecting to another machine and then configuring that. So, terminal. Oh. Let's see if I can call. Yeah, I can. Okay, cool. <clears throat> 172 host name 172 dot 16 dot 43 dot 128. Port number is 5001. And telnet. All right, so this is a very good thing. Uh, remember, if you connect to a device uh, like this method from via IP address or with a serial cable and you have just a blank screen, press enter a couple of times. As long as your baud rate or the port number is correct, you will be able to connect <clears throat> or see some input or oh, output, sorry. All right, so we're gonna click on, and not click, we're gonna type in enable. Enable basically, uh, it's like a privilege or ask, uh, elevated prompt. So you have more rights, so you have uh, more um, commands at your disposal. Configure basically just say, it's self-explanatory that we are gonna configure so it's saying you have to type terminal so you are t configuring VLAN number 10 now you're gonna name it as and press exit now you're gonna interface range E0 forward slash 2-3 so these are the interfaces that it will apply to S switch for access VLAN 10 oh. so I was right the first time and so and tells it that take hey, configuration is done. Now what we're gonna do is copy running config startup configuration. So copy running config startup config and it saved it. Now we can see show VLAN.
Oh, okay. So this one is building that. We have our prompt again. So at prompt, we cannot. And you can see. So enet. U certify is the name that we give. It's active. And you can see that that was the interfaces. So by default, 0, 1, 0, and 1. So ET is Ethernet. All right, so I hope this video has helped you. You need to know just a little bit more to make sense what exactly it is. All right, so Dawson, make sure you have closed the terminal window. Okay. All right. We can type in exit, close. Okay, we have to actually get close the connection before we can access it. All right, task is done. Record my answer. I hope this video has helped you. If it has, please rate, comment, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you in the next one.